Hi, my name is Andreas. I assume you have set up your connections and you know how to navigate. Let me explain you in detail on how you can filter within the CI Hub panel. Filters are a very powerful tool to help you navigate and find whatever you need within your program. To explain you in detail on how filters work, let me switch over to my laptop. So let me show you on how we filter within CI Hub. We do have set it up um, our connections. I've already showed you on how to navigate within the system. Now let's, let's take a look on how we can filter with the system and how we can use the filter to drill down the results and navigate within the CI Hub panel. It's very easy. We are now again within the panel. We are now in the folder navigation and within the folder navigation, I can scroll through the folders. Or we can also go to the search. And we can search or full text search within all the parameters of the system. Every time I now get all my results based on my search, I can now start and filter. Let me go back to my folder navigation. I am now in my folder assets. And we see 67 results within that folder. Now you can filter within all given options of your system. We support standard fields plus custom fields. So based on the options of your system, you can use facets or filters. Let us filter it by use case or by asset type or by region. So let us now filter all the asset types by green. So now I get all the results which have the tag green. To remove the keywords you don't want, just click on the red X. If you have deleted it, you come back to the original selection. You see, you have back your 67 results. If your system does not support facets as search, let me show you how it worked there. Let me switch to my Dropbox. Let's go down the folder structure. In my case here, it's pictures. Let's go into my folder with metadata files. And here you now can search all your Dropbox content by the keywords from the images. You click on filter and you now see all the keywords of all the results. So now select show me everything what is colorful. You can also drill down further by selecting another keyword. Let us just select Krabi as an additional keyword. And now you drill down all the results down to just one, which is Krabi and colorful. And again, you can reset the search by just clicking on the red X and you come back to your original result. That function works if you're in the folder navigation in the same way as it would work with search results. So I hope that video gave you an overview on how to navigate and filter your content. If you have any questions, there are a couple of other videos explaining the rest of the panel. Just refer to them by clicking on the small information icon. Thanks a lot and enjoy the day.